Hey guys, welcome to Classic Tanking, and today we're going to have our Shaman tanking the Stockades. Now, I'd say it's pretty likely that there hasn't been very many Shaman tanks that have actually done the Stockades. I hope you enjoy the video. You're in the instance, yeah. right, Alex? Yep. Okay, cool. So, Someone else just joined me. The yeah. succubus thing is in here again. Okay, cool. So, Alex, you're leader, so invite uh, Sarah there. Invite me. Oh, wait, it was. That was party lead. Whew, that was close. Um, just so you guys know, my, my dagger skill is pretty much nothing. Yes, my threat is definitely not very good without my uh, weapon skill. <laughs> Targor the Dread, the King of Threat, makes quick work out of this orc. Well, dang, look at that ring. Yeah, that ring is the, like, one special ring I can drop in here. You know, this... This dungeon could really use some more decorative fillery. There, perfect. <laughs> Dextran Ward, another easy fight for the Shaman tank. Was this special guy? Yeah, this is the boss. There's another one of those under down under guys. Yep, there's a. <laughs> we need to check every single one. <laughs> Can I have some pants, please. They should have just had some guys in here dancing or something too. Cam Deep Fury, no dwarf stands a chance against our shaman. You want to pull with a lightning bolt on the boss and follow up with an earth shock on the primary kill target. Try to tank the boss away from group members to reduce his chain lightning damage. <laughs> a lot of lead up for you just putting some more decorations around the face, huh? All they asked for was some cabinetry. We got away with it. Basil Thread. Make sure you have your stone skin totem down. This boss can stun and hits pretty hard, especially if you're lower level like we were. Thanks for watching the Shaman tanking video. Next up, the Shaman is heading to Black Fathom Deeps. Well, it was the first time we did this, like, single try. Um, we got a chest right here. Now, there might be respawns, so...